Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum, my dear students. How are you? I hope you are enjoying the best of health. I welcome you in my class that is English for grade 1, and we are learning unit 16. Its title is Professions. My dear fellow teachers, this lesson plan, PowerPoint presentation, and worksheet links are given. You may click it, download it, follow it as it is, or modify it for your convenience. I'm going to deliver my lecture according to this lesson plan. Yes, my dear students, today we are going to start reading and understanding the text of this unit. And before this, I have taught you how to locate specific factual information. I hope you remember. And I have also taught you about sight words. So these techniques which we have already learned is going to help us to understand our today's SLOs which are locate some specific factual information and pronounce and match spoken words with written words. These are our today's SLOs. Let's start with the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah mentions in Quran Surah Al-Ikhlas verse 1 till 4. Say... He is Allah, the one. Allah, the self-sufficient, he begets not, nor he begotten, and no one is equivalent with him. Yes, my dear children, what this beautiful surah tells us, better this surah is a small, brief introduction of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, who is Allah. Allah is one. It is a fact. And he is self. Allah is self-sufficient. It is also a fact. Because we know, we have studied about fact, a fact which is true. So this is 100% true. Now, my dear children, look at this word. It spells as one, O-N-E. But its pronunciation is different. So we have read this is the way how we learn about sight words, remember? So this is a sight word because it's different from the way we pronounce, it's different from its spelling, right? So Alhamdulillah, these verses taught us about Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and we learned, we revised what is a fact and what are the words which are pronounced and written in a different way. So now you, all of you open your book and uh, it's page number 109. What you're supposed to do, you will look at the picture or pictures and predict what the lesson is about. Why do you guess what this lesson is about? Pause the video, answer this question to your teacher and then come back. Yes, my dear children, as these pictures are telling us and the title of this unit is Professions. By the way, what is a profession? Do you know? But a profession is something what we do to earn money. And before doing that, we learn how to do this. For example, we learn to how take care of patients and then we become we can become a nurse. We go through all the medical studies of human being and then we become a doctor. Likewise, for every profession, for any work, first we learn how to do that. Then you do that to earn money. That is called a profession. Okay, so there are many professions. Definitely your Baba is working. He is he's a professional what he has done you may discuss with your parents okay so now we are going to learn about few professions there are few which are mentioned in your book so let's see what those profession is the first one is postman look at the picture he is a postman so what does a postman do let's see all of you listen carefully i'm going to read it postman a postman is a person who delivers letters, money orders, invitations, and parcels, right? So what does a postman do? He delivers letters, money, or money orders. What are money orders? When you send money from one place to another, that is called money order. 
invitations like you want to invite one of your friend who lives in another city you write an invitation that is please come and join us that is invitation and parcels you want to send gift or cloth or anything that is a parcel so who does who delivers all these things a postman right so it is a fact this is a fact a postman does all this work he wears a khaki uniform so khaki is the color of uniform of postman he goes from door to door and delivers the mail this is what a postman do mechanic mechanic so what does a mechanic do a mechanic is a person who works in an auto workshop he repairs what does repairs mean he fix if something gets wrong he corrects that repair means to fix the thing which is not working which is not working properly so he fix all kinds of vehicles and what are vehicles but anything which you use to move from one place to another for example it can be a motorcycle a car a van a bus whatever so it's a vehicle so what does a mechanic do he fixes whenever your vehicle is not working properly he repairs that vehicle right he works as an auto engineer means he works as an assistant to engineer right so this is what a mechanic do right this is also a profession so i'm stopping my reading over here now you are going to do an activity so what the activity is your teacher will divide class in pairs one student will say a word and the other will look here that word in text and vice versa now the other will say a word and the first one will locate it this is how you will work and students will locate factual information in pure so this is the text we just read first you one will say a word for example i'm that person who is going so i'll say find out where postman is written so they will say it's written here where who is written that's right this is how in a playway manner you will locate words and after that you will locate factual information so all of you pause the video enjoy the activity and then come back yes my dear children are you done with it good job wasn't it a fun learning very good fun way of learning so here is a comprehension what you are going to do you will answer these questions the text we read these are questions from that text so first you will answer these questions orally then you will write the answers in your notebook so pause the video complete this task and then come back yes my dear children are you done with it good job now it's time for your homework so discuss with your parents and learn about different professions at home as i told you in the beginning of the lesson discuss about profession of your father your uncle and many more whom you know so in this way you will come to know about many more professions in shada all right so here is a worksheet my dear fellow teachers this worksheet lesson plan powerpoint presentation links are given you may click it download it and kindly provide a printed worksheet to students for practice and my dear students what you are going to do here is a paragraph you are going to look at specific factual information from here so what we have learned we learned how to locate specific factual information in text and we also pronounced words and then match these words with the written words so in this way we achieved our slos to locate some specific factual information and pronounce and match spoken words with the written words are we done with it yes so that's it for today tomorrow i'll come again with a very interesting lesson 
till that time keep learning and take very good care of yourself thank you and allah hafiz